Hello, hello, hello. Welcome to my channel, my dear friends. My name is Avilash and I'm a trader next door. In this video, I'll be analyzing the chart of USD CHF, US dollar, Swiss franc. So if you're watching my videos for the first time, then please subscribe to my channel for regular market analysis and do check out the Forex analysis playlist on my YouTube channel for the analysis of other players like Euro USD, GBP USD, Gold USD, and many more. So let's get started. So this is the photo chart of USD CHF in front of us right now. And as you can see that market was in strong uptrend and after hitting this particular level 0 0.9330 market faced some resistance and market came down. And after taking support here again market is trying to go up. So if we just consider this particular portion of the market here, then we can see right now market is bullish. Simple words, market is under the dominance of buyers. But if I zoom out the chart, then we can see we have a resistance at this level for quite some time. Market has been trying to cross this level for quite some time and market is unable to do so. So therefore, this level is a very strong resistance for the market and it has become very much clear to us. So on Monday, if market goes up, okay, if market goes up and if market reverses from this particular level, we can take a sell position here. This is our first trading opportunity and in this chart, I think that this is the most uh, safe trading opportunity considering this as a very strong sub resistance 0 0.9330 and if market reverses it will also look like a double top pattern to us okay. generally in double top pattern as per the theory you should only take a sell position if market breaks this neckline but I say if the rejection is good enough you can take a sell position here because what does resistance mean? Resistance means a place of sellers. If you find that sellers are still present at a level, then definitely you can take a sell position at this level only. Why you should wait for this level? You do not need to wait. Okay. So if market reverses from this level of 0 0.9330, you can take a sell position and this is your first trading opportunity. Clear? But if you are looking for a faster trading opportunity, then if market goes up on Monday after the market opening, if market goes up on Monday and if market crosses this level 0 0.9290, okay. if market crosses the level of 0 0.9290 level, then also you can take a buy position why because this level has been acting as a temporary resistance for the market yes not a very strong one like this level at the top this is a temporary resistance for the market so if market crosses this temporary resistance then this will be the new support for the market okay this will be the new support for the market and you can take a buy position here as well if market goes up on Monday just make sure that you are not buying uh, as soon as the market opens because let the market settle down after the market opening wait for at least four to six hours and just observe the price if you see that after four to six hours seven hours market is trading comfortably above this level then you will get the confirmation that yes this is the new support uh, market has crossed the temporary resistance and it is good to buy second this is our second trading opportunity but yes in comparison to this one this is a more safer trading opportunity that i discussed as the first one first trading opportunity <laughs> but on the other hand on the other hand if market fails to go up and market comes down then the other next trading opportunity will be available at 0 0.925 9240 this is our next trading opportunity or a third trading opportunity so if market comes up and bounces from this particular level we can definitely take a buy so this is our third trading opportunity so first trading opportunity is at the top 
if market reverses from the level of 0 0.9330 we can take a sell if market crosses the level of 0 0.9290 and goes up we can take a buy not a very um, safe level but yes we can go for it our second trading opportunity but if market fails to go up and comes down to a level of 0 0.9250 or 40 and bounces we can take a buy so these three are the trading opportunities on USCHF chart that I see for Monday. If you have any other options on USCHF chart, then please write down in the comment section. I would love to learn from you. And this is it. Hopefully you've understood. And whatever you do, my dear friends, please follow proper risk management because see, this is my analysis. I can be wrong as well. So do not risk more than two to three percent of your trading capital. Bye bye. Take care. See you on Monday.